great. Hopefully this is recording. Okay, guess what? We're going to play some Ace 3 VR. New update came out today. Let me just get to the center of my play space here. Uh, it's Alpha 2. And uh, as you can see, we got a lot of new stuff to uh, try out here. And uh, some new changes to the explosives as well. So let's get into it. Uh, hold on, let me just check my battery levels for my controllers, because it's been a while since I played. Sorry about that. Again, doing some personal stuff outside in real life. But let's spawn up some SOSIGs. All right. So today, uh, there's not much in terms of additions, aside from the new, um, what's it called, furniture. But there have been some changes to the explosives, so I'm going to try that out go to support so let's see hold on uh, I don't know if he did any of this other stuff but uh, let's go with some of the uh, fused or some of the uh, more uh, unique uh, things here let's grab ourselves a lighter and uh, impact grenades I think uh, were added as well so that's great. Uh, we'll, we'll try that hairspray can later. Oh, does this work now too? Let me see. Just grab this and grab the detonator. Come on, where's the uh, where's the thing? There we go. Okay, let me just stick that there. To do spawn lock those. Um, okay. And also, I think we got some ordnance that work as well. So let's grab ourselves a, uh, let's grab the thumper, the M79. See if that will work. And, well, we'll check out all these other ones uh, in a minute. So let's try, yep, of course, and I think Anton showed off the impact grenade. So, whoop. you should see that effect. I think. Uh, I'm not using the spectator camera, so you can see that, right? So that works, obviously. What about the dynamite here? Let's, uh... Oops. Stick that there. Oh! I think that will work, right? Okay, cool. Of course, the banana, banana need. The ben banana grenade, whatever. <laughs> oh, darn it. Right on his feet. Okay, cool. What about the spam? I think this needs to be in remote. Well, it's it's been a while since I used the spam, so let's just... Uh, Oops, that didn't work out too well. Hey, right, hold on. Yeah, right, it was just that. And then we go back, and let's grab our detonator here. Okay, cool. So that works. Nice. Let's grab our grenade launcher here. It should work. Let's avoid the uh, flame there on the uh, Zippo. Hmm. Okay, we were just too far. All right. But that works. So cool. And there's a new grenade or explosive damage to the uh, Sosig enemies. Actually, you know what? Can't do that with everything turned on. But I want to hear the meaty, uh, meaty chunks falling, so... We're going to follow by example here. Uh, Anton loaded up. Let's get the um, Benelli here. Let's grab ourselves some shotgun shells. Okay, cool. And let's grab ourselves a uh, suppressor. Attachment, muzzle device, whatever. doesn't matter. Any suppressor will do. Oh, I should maybe spawn slugs, but that's okay. K 
Okay, let's just throw that away. Ooh, very uh, moist. That's the word, right? Very moist. Very wet. I wonder if we can grab the chunks. Oh, no. Well, all the sosigs are dead. So let's just clear all these sosigs. Oops. They're the sosig guns. I meant to spawn sosigs here. Okay. I wonder if I can pick this up. Oh, I can't. Nope. Need to add some. Oops. It's face mask. Oh, come on, get in there. I think I got all of them. Wait, there you go, the little meat chunks. Falling, making meaty noises. Cool, cool. All right, well. Now that that's out of the way, we've got ourselves some furniture to play around with. So basically this is the upcoming stuff that's uh, coming in the future. Don't know if it's uh, anytime soon, but now we got some furniture we can... Hmm, okay, cool. So basically you take the little, uh, little uh, NPC spawner here, Anton's added the categories. We can spawn a whole bunch of stuff. Furniture G, I think, is all just crates. So... Okay, that's crate A. You can see that. Let's take a look at that. I'm going to reach over and grab this thing. Cool. Alright, crate B. I guess it looks like crate A, but... I think Anton said that they have different uh, ways of breaking. Whoop. <laughs> crate C. Oh, go this way, this way, please. There we go. There, okay. Crate D. Oh, okay. Okay, just nope, nope. Balance, come on. There we go. Crate F. Oh no. I can't grab that, so I'm going to try it this way. It's going to be upside down. <laughs> there we go. Got our crates there. We got a couple more crates here. Crate 2A, which is these big ones. Cool. I can't put that there. Let's just put this on the other side. Ooh, no. Okay, cool. Got some crates here. Let's try to break them. And let's spawn ourselves an attach. Oh, sorry, not attachment. Uh, <clears throat> melee. Let's see. Sword. What we got? What we got uh, in terms of swords here? I never use these things. I'm not really much of a sword uh, user. Improvised. Let's grab a uh, machete. I've used a machete before. In real life. But, uh, yeah. Alright. Well, <laughs> not hard enough. No, that's not what I wanted. Oh, I can't grab these. I forgot. 
I can't laser grab them. All right, we're going to go back here. Anton said he was uh, adjusting the damage, so some of these melee weapons might not work. Okay. <laughs> it just reminds me, like, uh, you know those competitive um, knife... When they make knives, right? I guess they call them knife sports, right? When they line up all the specific things and they got to cut through the rope and then they got to do this and that and cut through like water bottles. This lineup kind of reminds me of that. <laughs> all right. Yeah. Oh, that one's a little tough. Oh, it broke. Hey, that one's got a nice little brake pattern right there. That's pretty cool. Can we stick our uh, machete in there? No. Oh, uh, yeah, it's, it's, you know, colliders and stuff. All right, more force. There we go. Oh, that's pretty cool. Some of these bigger crates. Oh, that's satisfying. That is very satisfying. Although, let me check my performance here. Oh, we're still good to go. All right, not bad. All this uh, stuff lying around. I'm looking at the Steam uh, performance graph on my computer here. It's all green line. Very flat, very nice. No slowdowns. That's good. I think Anton wants us to stress test this stuff. All right. Oh, man, where do I put this machete? I don't know where to... You know what? Let's get rid of some of these explosives I don't need. I don't need the dynamite. I don't need the banana. Banana -y. Banana -y. Put the machete over there. I do have my, uh, I have my, oh. I really want to, I really want to stress test this, so, oops, let's just spawn a whole bunch of crates, for now, let's try uh, these big ones, 2A, just, uh, just put a whole bunch of these crates all around. Let's see how many we can spawn before my computer decides to, uh... No, still green. That's pretty good. All right. We can put a whole bunch more. Let me check the performance graph. Oh yeah, that's still flatline right there. That's good. Oops. Now, the, 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 the thing that might be an issue is when all these things start breaking apart. That's the problem right there. Might run into that. Oh, let me check my performance graph here. Sorry about the head whip there. Still green. It's good. All right. Got ourselves an impact grenade. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe not. Let's not use an impact grenade. Oh, I do have, yeah, the slams. Okay, oops. That's, uh, I need to move away from my wall. I was close. All right, we're going to have to place this in the center of uh, all of this destruction right here. We'll just do one slam and see how the uh, performance graph tweaks out. I wish I could see it at the same time. You know what? I'll position myself so I can see it, and you can see the destruction uh, there we go. That'll be good. All right. When this baby goes off, <laughs> oh, I don't know what's going to happen. We're just going to blow up this warehouse of stacked crates. Okay, performance graph looks good. Wow, that actually runs pretty well. Not bad at all. That is pretty good. I saw no spike in the performance. So, yeah, this is uh, pretty pretty good. Let's let's toss in uh, another couple of these babies in there. Oh. Stick that there. Ooh, throw another one right there. Hey, why don't we just do one more right there? Okay, good. Let's get back a little farther. Oh, we got a we got a couple pieces uh sitting up on that ledge up there. All right. Get out the detonator. Oh well, we are. You know what? We're gonna we're gonna take a hit from this, but uh, that's okay. This is all in the name of science. I'm checking out the performance graph. 
Wow, not bad. No slowdown or anything. All right. <laughs> Makes me think I can probably stack a couple more. A couple. I mean, a lot more. Oh, this one's this one survived. Hold on. Oh no. <laughs> that was that was next to my wall. That was close. Okay. I felt my finger like brush up. <laughs> oh, that was close. I almost went crazy there. Okay. Controller seems to work. Oh, I need to find the center of my play space. Sorry, I just keep moving around here. Okay, let's that's center. That's the center. Nothing in front of me. Nothing behind. Okay, good. Yeah, my room has gotten a little smaller because I've got all this stuff in here. It's, it's a little hotter now, so I have a little fan set up. All right. Just to make sure I don't want to break anything. <laughs> it's one of the pains of VR. You're swinging stuff around and suddenly, uh, you know, you have a broken monitor or a broken fan or whatever. So checking up all this stuff here, we got some... Uh, a nice little uh, coat coat rack or uh, clothing rack spins around yeah that's pretty cool ooh hey oh yeah the, that's right anton talked about this right the uh, let's let's spawn the options panel here uh, input controls no no that's not it uh, nope that's not it either yes let's hold let's hide the controller geo there's a little bit of a weight, I guess. Weight, or there's a there's a there's a delay when you're moving heavy objects like this. That you can see, that's what Anton was talking about. Let me. I can't grab the clothes. That'd be, <laughs> that'd be. Yeah, well, that's all right. I don't really need clothes. But yeah, there's a little bit of weight, a little bit of a um, lag, I guess you could say. So you try to try to push this. Uh, Am I grabbing it? Oh, no. Okay. Might need to... Go the other way, please. Oh, nope. I'm just dragging it now. But let's just grab this. Oh, it's a little heavy. I need to grab both. I don't know actually where to grab. Hold on. I don't think I can lift this. Huh. Yep, I and Tom will probably change that. You know what? I also need to spawn a weapon. Let's grab ourselves a um, American 90 with the uh, 1080 magazine. Let's get rid of some of this stuff. Uh, you know what? Do I need the blooper? No, I'll just throw this away. We got the slam. So we should be okay with that. Let's uh, just here. Forgot how to load this thing. Oh, this way. Wait, hold on. Uh, controllers are colliding. Wait, hold on. It's this way, right? There we go. It's a little hard because the controllers collide. Wait a minute. the stock here all right now how was I supposed to reload this again there we go all right so uh, probably could have chosen a better weapon for this but uh, oops Ooh, nice sparks yeah uh, maybe 22 LR is not that great of a choice. Let me try something with a bit more power. Let's grab a battle rifle here. Um, hmm. Hmm, what should I use? H51A1. The folding stock? Okay, yeah, let's grab one of these. 7.62, man. 308. Okay. This does not fit there. That's a shame. Oh, man, I am out of space. You know what? I'll just uh, grab another melee weapon later on.
Oop. Extend this. All right, let's see what uh, 7.62 does to this uh, coat uh, clothing rack. Oh, wait. Wait a minute. If I remember correctly, from what I've heard, uh, the bullets don't do anything. So, yeah, that was just a pointless exercise, right? <laughs> All right. Well, yeah, and I think Anton said that he was he he hasn't implemented uh, uh, objects being affected by bullets yet. Well, yeah, most some of the odds. I don't know actually. You know what? Let's just use, use an explosive. We got these things, and we can spawn some more, so we don't have to worry about it. So. Huh, that is weird. Uh, maybe explosives don't work either. Again, this is an alpha, you know, whatever. It's, you know, it, it's a work in progress. So let's grab ourselves a fire axe. Maybe that will work. Oh, man. How do I, uh, oh, that, there we go. Well, get more power if you double hand this. Yeah things well built all right you know what oh well all the other stuff is broken let's just uh, get rid of this uh little bookcase there there we go hey that's pretty cool <laughs> cool all right you got destructible objects ah oh, man i didn't get to break those that's okay all right, well, let's take a look at some of the other stuff that uh, was included here. We got the crates, showed that off. Uh, man, I wish we could clean up this stuff, but we'd probably have to, uh, oops, did I touch my microphone? Oh no, sorry about that. We'll probably have to uh, reload the scene, so let's reload the scene here. Everything's back to normal. Nice little table here. Can't lift it up. That's not good. Huh. We need a little bit more strength, I guess. <laughs> yeah. We'll need to, uh, I think that will be need to... Oh, yeah, Anton will probably need to work on that. But that's still pretty cool. All right. So let's grab ourselves our little thing on bobber here. Spawn so sig. These are bookshelves. So we got a bunch of bookshelves here. Okay. Oh, oh that's a little... Oh, that's a little... Yeah, yeah, okay, cool. We're going to blow all this stuff. Let's let's spawn all these items. Whoa, that one's a big one. Oop. The last of the bookshelves here. Nice wide one. Coffee table A. Oh, you know what I should have done? I should have spawned some Sosix in here as well. I don't know what's going to happen if I start spawning Sosix. Oh, 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 no, don't break your neck on that uh, bookshelf there, buddy. Okay, we're going to spawn a whole bunch of Sosix. All right, we got coffee table A. Coffee table B, you guys, uh, you guys need a little coffee table? There we go. Yeah, more of those. D, E, coffee table F. Oh, you know what? Our Sosix need places to sit, so let's spawn in a couch there. Couch A. There we go. Oh, nice, nice looking, uh, nice looking wooden couch there. Haven't seen one of those in a long time. I remember those. Okay. All right, and then we got some lamps. Standing lamp A. Lighting. Oh, that one's a little too heavy. Hold on. Let me uh, put this up properly. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, man. Oh, well, it's just going to fall, I guess. Put a lamp in the corner there. Cool. What do we got else? Uh, dining chair. Dining table circle. Ooh, 
for the patio. Oval. Rectangular. Square. All right. Got some lounge chairs. Nice. Have a seat, gentlemen. Oh, hey, that look, that chair looks pretty cool. Pull to the ground there. D. That's E. F. Uh, an ottoman. Yeah. Well, you know, you gotta rest your feet, you know? Oh, hey, that one belongs to that one. Yeah. All right. Planters. We got some plants. Now, liven up the space a bit. Add a little bit of color, some greenery, you know? Oh, that's a little tiny cactus. <laughs> Got some, uh, what are they called? Uh, I forgot what they're called. I'm not really a gardener or plant kind of guy. Got some vases, vase or vase, whatever you want to call it. Add a little bit of uh, sophistication. Can we stack them on the table? Yeah, we can. I should have done that with the planters. <laughs> Oh, no. Oh, come on. This thing's in the way. Let's let's get rid of this. Oh, can we get rid of this? No, we can't. Huh. There we go. That's fine. Don't worry about it. All right, so we got some uh, racks here. Rack double. Ooh. Double stand. A little single rack. Hmm. Huh. That's a double. Yeah, that's a double. Single stand. Okay. Rack tall. Rack underwear. Oh, yeah. I guess those six do wear underwear. Huh. Rack wood. Wood single. Shopping cart. Table coaster. Oh, table casters. Oh, that's a table on uh, caster wheels. Okay, cool. <laughs> I was like, just a table caster? Like, I don't know. All right, let's spawn some crates to put on these things. All right, let's create a... Uh, let's put a crate inside this shopping cart there. Put crate B here on this table. So crate D. There. You know what? I'm going to put this crate on this couch. There we go. Good stuff. And a crate here. These big crates are just going to be on the ground. What do the Sosigs do when, when the objects are in the way? I want to know. So let's actually, you know what, let's set them to wander. Let's see what happens. And I'll, let me check my performance graph. It's looking good. Not bad. Let's uh, wander fight, right? They're the, oh, they're just going to... Oh, no, they're going to try to grab the weapons in here. I should have... Uh, forgot, I forgot about that. They grab the weapons. Can they grab the weapons? I don't think they can. Here. Grab it. Grab that. There you go. Good, good job, guys. A oh wow, they just ruined all the bookcases. Maybe I should have booked the, put the book the bookcases on the uh, near the walls or stuff. Oh hey, <laughs> that guy's trapped on the table. Hey, stop knocking down the. Well, that, that those are broken already, so don't worry, don't worry about those. Hmm. Okay, he's checking out the clothes over there. Oh, I, I need some stuff here. Oh, that guy's uh, taking a taking a rest on the couch there. Sitting on the table. <laughs> We're putting too much humanity into these things. We need to uh, let's uh, let's not do that. Let's grab ourselves a um, grenade launcher. That might be be pretty good. Okay. 
two, three, four, five. Ow! Get, get, get out of the way, please. All right. Oh, I don't have any sights on this thing. Let me grab some sights. Attachment. Reflex sight. Let's grab ourselves the... Uh, all those sights short. There you are. All right. Oh yeah. You know what? Uh, hold on. One, two, three. There we go. That should make things easier for me to, uh, to reload. Let me look at my performance graph. Uh, not too bad. Huh, still good. Hey, this guy's still alive. Oh, I died. <laughs> well, that was good, I guess. All right, let me just uh, check out the damage we did here. Look at all this damage. Ooh, man, just destroyed everything. A couple of uh, things are still uh, standing, though. These bookcases. All right, I think I destroyed everything. Cool. All right, let's do a real stress test. What's the uh, what's the most complex object in here? Look like. Uh, let's see. Got a whole bunch of whoa, table is up there. Can we get that off? Oh yeah, there we go. It's hanging. <laughs> Piece of wood was hanging there. Okay. Wait, I think that was the crate, right? No, it was brown. Huh. All right. Let's see. Bookshelf. This bookshelf, I think. No, it was this one, right? No. Nope. That one. That one looks pretty complex. Let's punch a whole bunch of those. Ah. Uh, come on. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh no, that one's glitched out. It's okay. And look at my performance graph. Hey, it's actually running pretty well. Again, no slowdown. So you can tell. Oh, man. These things are just everywhere. <laughs> oh, it's going to be crazy once we start blowing our way through this. I need something with more ammunition than a grenade launcher. Six rounds. It's not quite cutting it for me. Uh, let's see. Ordnance. Hmm. Something with explosive. Shotgun might be pretty good. Magazine fed. Uh, hold on just a second. Do we have our, no, we don't have a spawn panel here. Let me just try something. Shotgun. Grab the, ooh, the scalpel. That might work. Let's 
select help type. Yeah, this one doesn't have any explosive uh, ammunition, so let's not use this one. Might as well use the scalpel. So, let's grab it. Oh, yeah. There we go. This one. Select help type. We need some high explosive. Oh, it's already high explosive. Yep. Forgot about that. Let's open this. And... Yeah, okay. Oh, I don't have any sights for this thing. Need to customize it. Let's go with a... Um, something nice here. LCO. And let's put a uh, stock on this thing. Where'd you go? There you are. Okay. This will work. Oh my goodness. Takes a while for it to blow up. Or, uh... <laughs> Those effects, man. There we go, finally. I think I need something a little bit with a little bit more kick. Or you know what? We can just uh we can just spawn a whole bunch of grenades here. No, not this one, sorry. I want the uh, grease weasel. Where is it? There we go, the grease weasel. Big chunky boy, okay. Just grab this. Oh god! That was bad. <laughs> I'm dead. Okay, let's try that again. Need to figure out the positions for this stuff. There we go. Three here. Okay, cool. <laughs> Got grenades everywhere. Okay. Now we need to actually. Ugh. Oh, nope. Oh, there we go. Okay, good. Oh. Oh, that, yeah, my computer doesn't like that. Oh, yeah, we're getting some red spikes here. <laughs> oh, man, a lot of, lot of slowdown here. Yeah, a lot of, uh, it looks red to me, right? Sort of orange, I guess, but that's probably because I can't see close up. Oh, uh, let's throw one over there. Oh, goodness, that's bad. Oh yeah, a lot of frame rate there. A lot of frame rate drops. Ugh. Oh yeah, look at that frame rate drop. There's too much stuff going on. Oops. Wait, I still have two grenades. Uh. Oh yeah, that frame rate is just dipping. That is... Oh, look at that spike. There's a lot of red there. But, I mean, it's kind of understandable. You got all this stuff flying around. So that's a stress test right there. Oh, this one is... Uh... Please stop. <laughs> Please stop. Whole pile of this stuff right here. Let's just throw a grenade. Yep. All right. Yeah. There's a lot of a uh, lot of stuff happening there. 
Uh, looks like it's... I want to check out my graph here. Looks like it's okay so far. But... Yeah, that's a lot of lag right there. <laughs> well, there we go. A little stress test for you. Surprisingly, you can put a large amount of items in one location and get away with most stuff. But I guess this uh, book bookcase, bookshelf, is a little uh, complex. But, I mean, I spawned like, what, 50 of these things? No exactly know how many. Let's just reload the scene. Ooh. All right, everything's back to normal. Everything's smooth. Everything's great. But well, we'll do one more thing. Let me uh, let me spawn some crates here. Let's spawn a one of these bigger crates. Yeah, this. I don't think this. These crates are that uh, performance heavy, right? Is that the word that uh, somebody would use? Well, maybe once we start throwing grenades around. Oh yeah, just spawning a whole bunch of crates. Let's fill this room up. Keep going. We ain't stopping. Oh. One of the crates broke. Oh, I think I missed a couple of spots <laughs> over here. All right, let's uh, let's drop some of these crates here. Crates are surprisingly pretty light on their performance, so you can spawn a whole bunch. In fact, looking at my graph now, yep, it's still in the green, so we can still keep going. Oh man, my finger is getting tired. All right, let's just keep doing this. Oh, a couple of crates broke there. Oh man, my finger's so tired. Sorry, hold on. I gotta take a break. My finger is like, my arm is just like, shake out my arm here. Use my other hand. Just gonna... A whole bunch of crates. Ooh, man. Okay. No, I think that's enough. Whoop. Surprisingly, like I said, uh, crates are pretty light, so... I mean, obviously everything is still good in terms of, like, frame rate and performance. But then we start adding some explosives into the uh, into the area. Let's do the the spam again. I think that's a pretty big explosion. Oh no, we have to keep doing that every time, huh? All right, that's fine. Let's put the detonator here just in case. I don't want to blow things up. We got we got an ammo dump here. Whole bunch of whole bunch of crates with uh, lots of ammo, and then we got to blow them up. Uh, throw one in there for good measure. Ooh, little spot right there. Yep, there we go. Oh, I missed a spot here. <laughs> I was too busy spawning crates. Eh, right in the corner there. There we go. Okay, we've got a whole bunch of crates over here. Maybe if I just uh, stick a spam right there. One over here. We're going to blow this place sky high. Got a nice stack here. Can we can we do a little Jenga and put it in between? Yes, we can. <laughs> right there in between. A little crevice right there. Right there. Oh, yeah. Just put some over here as well. Oh, 
one in the corner there. There we go. Slide down in between those crates. Stick one right there. Oh, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> All right, we check this area out. I think I put something there. No, maybe not. I think there's something there. Yep, that we got some. Come on. Right here in the hole. There we go. Oh, well, went that way. One in the corner. One right here. Obviously right here. And uh, maybe one right there. Oh, did I put one in this area? No, I didn't. Right there. Okay, I think that's enough. We put we put a lot of uh, stuff here. Okay, let me see my graph. It's, uh, it's doing pretty good. In fact, hold on just a second. I want to try something here. I'll be right back, guys. All right, I'm back. And if you can see on the top right corner, top right, right, yes, right. I'm I'm left-handed, so I get confused sometimes. On the top right corner, you can see the uh, performance little graph along with whatever else is there. All right, let's see how this do, uh, this let's see how this does. Got my detonator in my hand. We are ready to go. Just checking out the uh, graph there. I don't know. I mean, I don't know if that's a good indication of like performance or whatever. So somebody can probably correct me on that. All right. Okay, I'm going to stay behind this wall here because I don't want to die immediately when all these uh, explosives go off. But let's see what happens. All right. All right. Three, two, one. I died. Oh, well, I, I guess... Uh, oh, no. <laughs> oh, wow. That's That's a lot. Oh. Oh, um, I guess I forgot to, uh, oh, yeah, that's right, I forgot to, well, anyways, it's it's slowing down, because there's a lot of debris here. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, that's a lot of damage right there. Oh, spawn all those crates. They're good when they're not broken, <laughs> I can tell you that right now. Oh. That's oh, that's a lot of that's a lot of frame rate issues right there. Oh man, everything's so sluggish, but I want to keep going. Let's see if the uh, let's see if I can make this crash. Oh no, it got stuck. Oh man, I don't have any any explosives here. Oh, here we go. Come on, get over here. Yeah, I need to actually spawn lock this. Where is the thing? Nope, nope, nope. Oh, everything is in slow motion. You guys want slow motion? You got it. Just spawn like 200 crates. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. What does the graph say? I can't see. So, I'll have to see when I, uh, I can't arm this properly. Hold on. Oh, no, the performance. Oh, no. It's so slow in my headset. I can't. Well, that didn't go far. It's too slow. Oh yeah, this is like this is ultra slow motion. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to reload the scene here. This is just Oh there we go. <laughs> oh everything's good. Everything's good. Ooh man, that was kind of disorienting, but uh yeah, just uh you can have a lot of crates, just don't break them. <laughs> uh but yeah, that's the update for today. Just a whole bunch of uh, destructible props, you know. And uh, you can stress test your machine to see if it'll run properly. 
Uh, it's uh, it's okay for mine. Uh, my 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 computer's not that bad, so at least I can have a couple of crates. And I don't think Anton's gonna stick 500 crates in a room and you have to destroy them, because that, as you saw right there, would be a pretty bad idea. <laughs> he's a you know he's a game developer who knows uh knows how to optimize. So yeah, that's about it for today, and uh, I'll see you next time.